All right, so you've seen this little portable blender on Amazon, Facebook, YouTube, uh, not YouTube, um, <laughs> Instagram. And you know, you gotta wonder, is it worth, is it worth it, right? Who knows, let's find out. It's, uh, it's relatively inexpensive. It's got uh, some instructions here, a little cord to charge it and the unit itself. I have to say, it's pretty stout. Jiva, or Jivai. I guess Jivai, right? One letter off from Levi. This is nice. This is a rubber, uh, doesn't does it unsnap? Nope, it doesn't unsnap, it's a rivet. Double click to start. Dang. Comes charged. Let's unscrew it. Got a little blade in there. Let's see, do we have some safety features? Double click. Can't start it without it being, um, without the top being on, so that's a good thing. This is way thicker than I thought it would be. It's got a rubber bottom on it and very grippy. I'm shocked that this is this high of quality, frankly. Anyway, let's see if it'll crush some ice. So a little ice, a little water. I, uh, this first time, I have absolutely no idea what it's gonna do. We'll tighten it down and uh, flip it on. Double click. Let's get rid of some water. Basically all I was doing is um, mixing it up. Oh, double click. All right, I'm pretty impressed. It is freezing. Uh, it has, <coughs> it's pulverized the ice. That little sucker is powerful. Holy cow, it made snow. <laughs> All right, let's rinse it. Let me see what I got in the fridge. We'll try and make a little smoothie. Well, I got all set up here to blend something and the battery died. Totally my fault. I should have charged it, like the instructions say, out of the box. Uh, but let's just uh, skip to the charging and we'll try this all over again. To charge it, you need one of these. It doesn't come with it, so we'll just plug that in. USB charger. And it has a magnetic snap feature like some watches or other, and you can only put it on one way. And as soon as it's connected, look at that, you get a light. So we'll just leave it there and see how long it takes to charge. Keep in mind, it crushed ice right out of the box. Uh, with no charging, so I'm expecting big things. Stay tuned. All right, we are charged and ready to go. It's been on there for two hours. I just pulled the magnetic thing off and uh, I put water in up to the bottom. I'm gonna put some uh, uh, frozen strawberries, just like I did last time, a little bit of uh, oats. It does say not to use seeds. And you know, I've got water in there because I want you to be able to see it. I'd use uh, almond milk or something. Let's go ahead and screw this on. Uh, push twice to start, flip it over. And we're going to just let it, let it in there. It does say that you'll need to shake it and agitate it. It could run for as long as three minutes.
tell you, I'm pretty impressed. It seems to have uh, pulverized, for the most part, those uh, oats, anyway. Oh, there, it automatically stopped. Let's flip it over. A little paper towel. So I guess if you were, you know, I don't know, RVing or boating and you wanted to, whoop, jeez, that would have sucked. You, and you want to uh, make a little fresh smoothie, you know, what would happen? And I would say this is a Met. It's pretty, uh, it's pretty smooth, you know, there's a little bit in there, which I personally wouldn't mind. Uh, you can imagine it would just really do a job on vegetables, leafy vegetables, spinach, kale, stuff like that. Uh, the instructions are really good. And uh, cleanup is super easy, you know. Obviously, just put some water in there, put it back together, blend it. I've rinsed this a number of times. It does seem to be sealed. This blade is super sharp, so you do want to be mindful of that. Uh, but I would, I would get this thing. Part you know. number here of this one is right there, GEBLA089-N. This is a blue one. Um, like I said, instructions were great. The uh, charger, you know, I just used a phone charger. Pretty good construction. And it did what it said it would do. It blended. So if you're out on a boat or, you know, you just require a fresh smoothie and you don't have any electricity, uh, then you could, uh, you could use this thing. You could even charge it off of a battery pack because of the USB type charger. So you be the judge. Uh, I think it's a pretty neat unit. I would actually, uh, I would actually use this uh, and it worked. It did what they said it would do. g -Buy, right there. All right, thanks so much for watching. If this video helped you make a buying decision, please subscribe and smash that like button. Stay tuned for more completely random videos. Thanks for watching.